Okay, so it is time for another ERG test. Um, I'm slated to go off at about 2.30 this afternoon and I've arrived down here a little over an hour ahead of time to get ready. Um, I'm somebody that likes to have a good comfortable cushion of time before my start time so that I have enough time in case something goes wrong. Not that anything ever does, but um, you know, something should. I like to have that extra cushion just in case. Also gives me plenty of time to get warmed up and to um, visualize and do things that I need to do to get prepared to execute my plan for today. Um, I am a little bit more nervous for this test than I have been for a lot of tests. Um, it's nothing new, it's nothing we haven't done before, but um, this particular distance is not necessarily one of my stronger um, things as an athlete, uh, basically. I am an anaerobic power athlete and these longer pieces are essentially my body fighting its own natural physiology for almost the entire test, which um, is not particularly comfortable, but it is something that I've been working on since I've been training with the team and I have been able to improve since I've been here. Um, today I am looking to PR, which is exciting and something that I personally feel I should have been able to do already earlier this year, but with the way things went this fall. I did have a little bit of a setback with my training and conditioning and now I'm looking to get back on track. So um, in some ways I do feel like it is time for a really good result on this particular test and so I'm excited about that but at the same time, um, you know, it's been kind of a long time in, in coming and um, so I'm just, I'm looking forward for it to be over. <laughs> so I'll check in again after the test is done and uh, hopefully have good news. Cool. Here we go. Okay, so the ERG test is over and I am cooled down and I am done chatting with everybody to check in and see how everybody else's tests went, which I still maintain is the best part of ERG testing by far. Um, chatting with everyone afterwards and just enjoying kind of the collective sense of relief after basically fretting the day away. <laughs> uh, we had kind of a late test today, so I did spend a lot of hours today um, just kind of dreading and waiting for the ERG test to start. But uh, I do have good news. I was able to PR today, which is awesome. Uh, feels really good to have um, a good, solid test. Um, after the last two this year, I haven't really been where I wanted them to be. So this one was um, a really good step in the right direction and getting back on, on pace in terms of um, improving and continuing to get faster and develop my, my fitness. Um, I was able to go about eight seconds faster than the last test that I did, and then uh, it's about a three second PR overall. So, um, you know, going back through the memory, it was really nice to see the split just kind of come down, 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 and the rate go up, 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 which is exactly uh, what I wanted to do. Um, I went right with the plan that I set for myself and was able to use that plan to achieve a goal, which is just a really good feeling um, with a test like this. So, uh, overall pretty happy and um, you know I never really look forward to doing more ERG tests but um, I will be looking forward to the next one in the sense that um, you know I, I get an opportunity to try and go even faster which is which is awesome so um, you know looking forward to doing some more training and getting ready for the next one whenever that may be and um, continuing to, to help push the team and, and improve as an individual so now it's time to enjoy the rest of my Sunday. Um, cool. That's it. Ciao.